Eat something, bitch. What's up with it, everybody? It's your boy, RDR, and welcome back to RDR Food Reviews. And today, we're going to take a risk today. We're going to take a risk because today, your boy is going to see if this rumor that I found out that a Checkers Rallies is in Texas. A Checkers Rally is in Texas. Checkers Rallies is in, check, uh, in Texas. Um, uh, Man, listen, I've been wanting to go to, to, to Checkers for a long time. For a long, long time. I've seen other mukbangers and other people get to try checkers, rallies, and it looked the food looks absolutely delicious. Of course, the fries is what they're really known for. Another thing is, I mean, you, you can get the fries at like Walmart or whatever, but another thing is, if this, from what the rumor that I heard is true, that there's only one checkers here in Texas, which is in Fairfield, Texas, which is off the interstate of I 45. Uh, man, I'm going to be so fucking happy and we're going to do it, do it big. You know what I'm saying? For real. No Jameis Winston. You know what I'm talking about? So what we're about to do is we're about to get on the road. We're going to hit up I-45. We are going to go and see if this checkers rallies is true. I hope it is because I don't want to be wasting no gas. So, uh, at the ATM. Uh, so I had to go ahead and get out the shillings, you know what I'm saying? Cause you, you never know how much shit is going to cost but anyway we're going to checkers rallies to see if this is true if not we'll find something else to do this is rdr food reviews eat something bitch So we're pulling up. Here's the drive through right here. Let's see what they got. Man, they got so much stuff. Okay. Okay, so this might take a minute. Just give me a second to scan through this menu. Okay, are you there? Okay. Can I get a, let me try your triple bacon zilla combo. Okay. Um, can I get a high C with that? Small, medium, or large? Um, large and large fry. Okay. Can I also get one of your uh, double, no, your uh, deep sea double fish, just a sandwich? Okay. Can I also get one of your uh, spicy chicken sandwiches, just a sandwich. Okay. And can I get an order of your loaded chili cheese fries? Okay. And um, can I also get a four piece of your mozzarella sticks? Do you want the marinara that comes with it or ranch? Um. Let me get let me get uh the marinara that comes with it. Okay. Also, let me get an order of your uh, funnel cake fries. Okay. And uh, I'm trying to see your wings. Can I get a five piece of your um your garlic parmesan wings? Your boneless. The boneless. Uh huh. Okay. And let me also get a regular. Um. A regular tropical punch Kool-Aid slush. All right. And that'll be it. Okay, so I have a triple bacon zilla combo, large with a fruit punch, a deep sea double, a spicy chicken, a chili cheese fry, a four-piece mozzarella stick marinara, a funnel cake fry, a five-piece boneless and garlic parmesan, and then a regular tropical punch slushie. Yes. Okay, twenty thirty-three eighty-nine. Please go for it. Thank you. 
All right, thank you. <laughs> She's probably like, dang, he ordered a lot of food. Yes, I did. You got to make this epic. First time for everything. All right, I'll see y'all in a minute. Refreshing. Yeah, I'm still waiting for my order, as you can see. But I had a lot. And I knew this Kool-Aid, uh, this Kool-Aid slushy was not going to make it to the house. No, I need a little Kool-Aid. <laughs> and I'm back. Man, after such a long, long drive, it brings us here to the fucking set. So, okay, so as you heard, what I got here is some chili cheese fries, some regular fries. I think these are funnel cake fries. Mozzarella sticks, the Baconzilla, the deep blue. This is like a double fish sandwich right here. And at the bottom is a spicy chicken sandwich. And I got a large high C. The Kool-Aid slushy didn't make it. Um, long story. Well, I was short. You saw. I, you know, Kool-Aid. That's all I have to say, say about that. So let's go ahead and get a quick moment of prayer. Father, thank you for this food I'm about to receive. Help this food nourish my body and make me stronger as a person, strong as a man. And please bless us that grow hungry. I pray to you, please find us something to eat. In your holy gracious my name we pray. Amen. Love you, Father. All right, now. All right, so let's see if we can get a quick thumbnail. Back here. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Back here. I got some Italian Parmesan chicken nuggets right here. Let's see if I can let y'all see that. Gotcha. All right, we'll show them later on. Later on. So, let's see if we can raise this up and get an epic thumbnail. If I got the way. Without dropping it. Ooh, oh shit. Now, it's time to feast. Man, it's been a long time coming. So, customer service was A1. People were cool. It was just an all around great atmosphere. So, if you got a, a rallies in your state, you're a winner. You know what I'm saying? I just heard so many people from like California, from Atlanta, you're all that man. They always talk about rallies and checkers. Uh, listen, these chili cheese fries, I know y'all seen them. Hey, they can call them my name. Look at this. This is how I would do my chili cheese fries. Look at this shit here. So sexy. Chili looks so good. Mm. Oh yeah. Now, now I'm kind of regretting not um damn it, chili is so good. I'm kind of regretting not getting that hot dog because they had a hot dog and it didn't have cheese on it. And it just had chili and red onions. And I'm like, I'm okay with onions now, but I don't like red onions. So maybe, maybe in the future. Maybe in the future. We'll save the funnel cake fries for dessert later. And this is the Italian. Parmesan boneless wings. Mm. Mm. Very garlicky, like off the bat. And it's weird and it's strange because you don't see any coating on it at all. There's no coating on it. It's just normal. The breading, but 
It's hella garlicky. Which I like, because I love the smell of garlic, but you don't want too much to make the breast smell like shit. <laughs> Not horrible. They're pretty good for bonus, you know? Let's go ahead and dump these out right here. Sorry if it's going out, in and out or whatnot. The, uh, the camera's in. Sometimes it goes in and out. Oh, wow. Mm. I love how they be cramming the fries up in there. Reminds me of Five Guys. They give you a lot, man. The fries, they remind me a lot of, um, they remind me a lot of, uh, Popeye's fries. But more seasoning. And yes, they are way, way, way better than the ones you get in the back. And you can taste, totally taste the difference. Okay. On to these cheese sticks, these mozzarella sticks. These mozzarella sticks right here. I can feel it that it's like, it's lightly breaded. So, okay. Little cheese pull. Mm. A lot of emphasis on the cheese. Lightly breaded. Just off by holding it, it was lightly breaded. But really good. They have this like certain seasoning that they put on everything because it's on the mozzarella sticks and it's on the fries. Hmm, that's interesting. Mm. I should have got more mozzarella sticks. These are hitting, boy. That's some marinara seasoning. Okay, so since it's Lent, you know, what I mean? <laughs> let's see what this deep blue fish or a double, it's a double fish sandwich. I've never seen a double fish sandwich, whatever. It's got two fish patties, some cheese, it's tartar sauce and some lettuce and whatnot on a sesame seed bun. Let's see what this is about. Mmm. I put, I mean, it's a little bit on lettuce. They can put a lot of lettuce on there, which is good because they're not on that Sonic shit. Sonic be giving, Sonic be putting a whole head of lettuce in motherfucking sandwiches. It don't matter what you get. You get in lettuce burgers in this whole, <clears throat> which is cool if you're a vegetarian. Boom. I can see why they put two on here. Because one just can't do it. These um, fish patties or whatever are hella thin. I like the fish. You don't get that much fish. You got a lot. It's it's like lightly breaded and lightly fish. They're super thin. They're like razor thin. You know what I'm saying? Like the damn razor foam. You don't even get much. Hmm. I wonder why I put a lot of lettuce on there and two fish patties on there <laughs> to get you full because they know one ain't up. Oh. That fish sandwich went all that. Let's just be honest here. But these chili cheese fries, boy, these could be up there. Mm-hmm. These could be Hall of Fame. <sighs> type of chili and cheese that you would get at a football game or a basketball game at a high school. Let that sit in. You know what I'm saying? Refreshing. 
Yeah, so far, I'm like all over the place like bird shit right now. But, let's see what the spicy chicken sandwich is. Spicy chicken sandwich. Uh, not that much lettuce. Uh, just a normal spicy chicken patty. And, uh, some mayonnaise at the bottom. Alright, so let's see what this is about. It looks plain gay. Um, kind of the same, Cuddy. <laughs> it don't have that much meat in that bitch, you know? The, just now, as I was speaking, I could taste the, the spice starting to kick up a bit. But not enough to make you glisten, Cuddy. Uh, lightly breaded, lightly with the, the, the chicken inside. It's not that much. Good thing I ain't flooded that much with lettuce. That's what you doing, Chucky. Damn, this must this this right here gotta be like on the value menu, cause this is a this is a little nigga food. Mm. Also, it must be fresh, cause I'm getting a lot of large chunks, a little large chunks of spicy chicken. Um, not chick spicy chicken of lettuce. I'm getting a lot, a lot of large chunks, man. That's weird. Oh, massacre that hook, boy. We might as well go ahead and knock this last mozzarella stick out. So far, I'm impressed with the mozzarella stick. Obviously, the fries. But Philly G fries is A++. The fish sandwich, I would probably give it a... I'd probably give it a C+. Plus. For I guess for a double fish sandwich, you know, I give it a C plus. It's not that bad tasting. It's just that wish that they would get better fish. You know what I'm saying? Because that ratio is not that good. This chicken sandwich, I would definitely. I ain't gonna lie. That bitch deserves a D plus. It's not that good. You know what I'm saying? I've ate a lot of chicken in my day, as you guys already know. Um, these garlic. The, pretty much the chicken, the chicken bites or whatever, the bonus chicken wings, is really, really good. I would give these more so on the B, a B, a B minus side. Um, it's really good how you put that little Sprite trickery on a nigga. With the garlic seasoning. I don't know how they finesse to put it in here, but, oh yeah. If this was, um... If this was like the 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 real like the real hundred percent whatever with the chicken and stuff, this bitch would be an A. Uh, it would be an A plus. But it's not, and I can taste the difference. But this regard technical error. And like I said before, the fries are trill. All right. And this right here is what they call the bacon zilla. Okay. Uh, it's pretty much, oh man, crunchy bacon, as you probably could have heard right there. Plenty of bacon, cheese, uh, it's a triple. I like this brioche bun, that's why it's all shiny and stuff. And uh, let's just get right into it, man. Without further ado, oh, look at that. Bacon, bacon, and more bacon. This might be more bacon in the baconator. Hold up. Alright, let's see what the bacon, bacon zill is all about. Mm-hmm. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Did they put cheese sauce in there? No, it's just mo cheese, man. Mmm. Church and nothing like Okay, listen. Bitch had me singing hoes. 
This right here, Cuddy, is one of the better bacon burgers that I've ever had in my entire life. I am not shitting you not, Cuddy. Number one, it has a great reminder. It makes you think of Wendy's when you taste into it. But this, like, I think bacon, I think the bacon area gives you, like, six strips of bacon. This shit is unlimited. This is for real a Baconzilla. It has mayonnaise, ketchup, cheese, meat, bacon, 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 repeat, bacon, bacon. And it's, oh, man, hold up. It's, it's ridiculous. And I love the brioche bun. The brioche bun touch on it, killer. These sesame seed buns right here are on some bullshit. You know what I'm saying? On some sesame seed bullshit. These, it's like they didn't give a fuck over here. This right here, Cuddy, this that nigga for real, for real. You hear me? God. Oh. Should have got two of them bitches, man. That is good for real. One day, I think I'm going to have to do a comparison of the Baconzilla versus the Baconator. Because, man, that's that's epic right there. Mm. That illuminated everything right there, cutting. Oh, my fucking mother. <laughs> Sandwiches over here, they were weak. I call it like a baby. I call it like a taster, baby. Holy weak. That's your bread one right there. I'm thinking about where I'm going to go if I'm lit, like 2 3 in the morning. I need to go take a run. I'm going to take a run to go get like 2 3 in this bitch. Hold up. Yeah. It's lit. Oh yeah. Getting ready to chop out like I did with that burger. dessert these are the funnel cake fries okay the funnel cake fries let's see what these are all about mm-hmm this is like powdered sugar up it's little treats huh they do like funnel cake nice little crispy crunch in the coating Mm. I don't know my wife might like these. Hey, love. Yeah. Hey, come here. Oh, shit. What? Hey, see if you like these funnel cake fries. Mm. You like them? They're good. They're good? Okay, take them with you. You want to try this? This is the bacon zilla. Has onions? No, it's got no, it got no veggies in that hoe. It's straight carnivore. Mmm. <laughs> she gonna look in there after I just told her it was in there. That shit is really good. That's my favorite. It tastes like Wendy's. Mm. Yes, I thought so. Anyway. This, these right here, this was the spicy chicken sandwich, and this was the uh, the fish thing or whatever. What the hell did you just do? Did you just took it apart? Too much bread. It's not enough fucking bread. You want to take the rest of it and run? What is it? That's high C. 
player. Dang, he just so just the, the, just dismantling everything I gave her. <sighs> Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. She distracted me. Her beauty. No <laughs> anyway. It's good, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I told you it was good. Anyway, the bacon jello was approved by my wife. Proof for me. These other two shits, these was hella weak. Uh, I cannot reiterate that again. Of course, the fries was lit. Two cheese fries were lit. Funnel cake fries is acceptable. I would give them on a scale. I'd probably give them a. I'd give them a B plus two. I wish they were much bigger than they are what they are. But they're very tasty though. Nice bite treat. Chili cheese fries are A. I can't even say that again and again. Alright, man. Gosh, I'm tapped out. This is fantastic. Thank you, everybody. Oh, shit. I just nutted in my lips. Shit. Thank you everybody for watching my Checkers Rallies Mukbang first time here on the channel. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's your boy RDR and like I always say man, hey look, food is a gift. So please give thanks. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also don't forget to hit that like button. And also hit that notification button when you hit that subscribe button. So you can get the latest, gritty, R R the latest greatest RDR food reviews, uh, vlogs, mukbangs, food reviews, etc. Challenges. I do it all, Cuddy Pauls. It's your boy RDR, and I'm signing out. God bless y'all. Take care already. I love you guys, and I'll see you very, very soon. And like I said again, food is a gift, so please give thanks. It's your boy RDR. Getting up out of here. I love y'all, and I'll see y'all soon. Good night.